Hey YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name is John. If this is your first time joining us, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button. And if you like this video, leave me a like on it. If you don't know who I am, my name is John Artsberger. I'm a high ticket affiliate marketer. I've been in affiliate marketing for the past five years. Um, this is all I do full time. Uh, I work from home and I do this and I actually earn a high six figure income. Uh, close to seven figures, I'll probably be there by the end of this year. Um, but what I actually do is I do a lot of affiliate marketing training. I do, um, that's what this channel uh, specifically is based around is just different trainings and uh, programs that I work with that I'm earning with. Currently, I only show you guys on these, this channel the programs that I'm working with. But what I always get asked is what is affiliate marketing? And that's what this video is based on today. We're not gonna be doing any kind of trainings. I'm not gonna be showing you any kind of platforms as far as you know their inner workings or anything like that. We're gonna be talking about what affiliate marketing is and how we can use it, how I use it um, to make money, right? So let's just do, a, let's start here. We're gonna start with a quick Google search. What is affiliate marketing? And the definition that we get is a marketing arrangement by which an online retailer pays commission to an external website or for traffic or sales generated from its referrals. So what does that mean exactly? Basically, an affiliate marketer is somebody who promotes a product or service and receives a commission when somebody that they were promoting to purchases that product or service. That's pretty much it in a nutshell. Um, why companies use affiliate marketing, um, there's many different reasons, but one is cheap advertising, right? The company doesn't actually have to start advertising the products itself. It can have affiliates do that. It saves an, an advertising budget. Any sales that are generated from an, an affiliate marketer typically wouldn't have occurred anyway. So the, the money that's, that the company has to pay out to that affiliate marketer is really just a benefit to the company because now they've had a sale that somebody else generated um, and uh, the, they wouldn't have had that sale to begin with. So they can share a percentage of that sale to an affiliate marketer. Um, uh, companies that use this, there's quite a few different companies. There's a lot of e-commerce companies, but some of the big ones are Amazon. So Amazon is one of the biggest affiliate marketing platforms in the world. Um, you might not have known this, but Amazon actually has its own uh, affiliate um, program, its own uh, um, website. Let me show you. I'll pull it up right now. It's called Amazon Associates. And this is Amazon's affiliate program. So Amazon has built, they figured out that, hey, we can sell a ton of products by allowing the world around us, any kind of marketers to start selling them. They don't have to put any money towards advertising for these products. And people can just go sell them. And this benefits not only Amazon, but it benefits um, the uh, stores that are inside of Amazon, the people that are selling on Amazon, because Amazon's agreement is, um, you know, it, it varies on what the percentage is that they share, but it's relatively low. I believe it's 4% uh, or 6% now um, um, is what they give to an affiliate marketer who makes a sale. So it's a win-win for everybody because nobody has to spend money on advertising. Actually, Amazon doesn't have to pay for any advertising. And look how big Amazon's grown and affiliate marketing is part of this reason why it's been to what it is, um, grown to what it is now. So it's a unique way of doing things, but it's been adopted now by a vast uh, um, array of different companies. Actually, there are a ton of e-commerce brands that build this into their brand now, um, as far as affiliate marketing goes. If you were just to do a Google search um, of uh, affiliate marketing products, you could find just endless amounts of websites talking about, you know, the top 50 affiliate programs, the top products to promote, the top, there's hundreds and hundreds of videos on affiliate marketing and different products that you can, that you can promote with it. But typically I break these products, these products up into a, um, a couple different, three different sections mainly, right? So physical products, um, and then digital products, and then programs. That's how I look at affiliate marketing. Uh, there's also some services and stuff thrown in there, but you could fit those in with programs. Um, but 
What does that mean? What is the the difference between um, marketing products and marketing for a program, for example? So a product would be like Amazon, like the products on Amazon. You go in there selling um, uh, physical products. They also have some digital products on Amazon, right? So those aren't actually physical products, but they're still products none, nonetheless. And that's where a lot of companies and brands come into play where they will have um, businesses that use uh, um, not physical goods, but either software or um, other products that you can use online for say online marketing. Some of these, um, I'll show you just an example here with this program right here. This is one of the programs that I've been working with uh, for the past year. I've earned a ton of money with it, but none of the products that this company has inside of it are um, physical. They are all digital products. Now they're based around uh, marketing, online marketing. A lot of products nowadays are based around online online marketing and that's because we can actually use those to market with, um, but they also understand the, um, the uh, benefit of using affiliates to do that as well. Um, and this, exa this example right here would be considered a high ticket program. This is, I'll show you some of these uh, in a second too, some high ticket, the difference between high ticket and low ticket, but high ticket uh, affiliate marketing is typically higher priced products. They give you a higher, uh, a higher amount of income you can make with them. For example, um, they may only offer you 50%, but maybe the product that they're selling is an $8,000 product. So now your uh, sale is $4,000 and that's what, you know, this, this, specific program that uh, that I work with here is it's a high ticket program. Some are like this program, right? This is a program I've started a few months ago and it is a low ticket pro uh, product and it's also uh, not a physical product, it is a digital product. It is a funnel builder. If you don't know what a funnel builder is, you can you can look that up. Some of the biggest pro uh, some of the you know biggest affiliate programs in the world are uh, based on funnel builders such as ClickFunnels. But this is not ClickFunnels. It's a much better product in my opinion. But um, it's low ticket. So typically low ticket will be things that build, um, at least the ones that I that I use will build recurring income uh, month after month and they're just smaller prices to get in with. This one specifically is $25 to start and actually it's based on this program right here that I teach with, that I uh, teach people about. Um, but it's a $25 program. This one right here uh, to get in and, and kind of get all the way in, you're looking at like $3,900, something like that. So that's the difference between the programs that are high ticket and low ticket. Um, but you know, that's it pretty much in the nutshell, what affiliate marketing is. I just wanted to make a quick video about that today because I get asked this all the time. A lot of people have this, th this uh, theory that affiliate marketing is like a pyramid scheme and it doesn't really make sense, but I see kind of where they're coming from because they see you selling things that aren't physical, but they're just looking at it in a, in a, in the wrong way. Um, to explain this a little bit more, actually, I, I can, I can break this down. Let's, let's just open up a whiteboard and I'll try to explain this. Oh, that's not the right one. see if this is the one. Yeah, this will work. So let me explain. I'll explain first off what a pyramid scheme is so that people know, because I'm sure that you guys have probably heard this a million times. You know, uh, affiliate marketing is like a pyramid. They think that because let me show you what a pyramid is. A pyramid is um, starts at the very top here and say this person sells something, right? Uh, with a pyramid, typically it's not a real product. So that's where they get the, the pyramid thought because they're, they're not looking at digital products as real products. But let's just pretend for a second uh, for the sake of showing you what pyramid schemes are. Um, a pyramid scheme is, you know, the top person sells, he sells down to this person and this person, and these people sell to this person, this person, and this person, right? Something like this. And it just works its way down and it keeps multiplying. It's also an MLM, multi-level marketing, but a pyramid scheme is basically multi-level marketing with no products. And that's where they get into the, the thing, you know, where the idea that affiliate marketing, because a lot of the products we promote aren't physical products, they think that they are pyramid schemes because they kind of look like that. The problem is there are no levels with affiliate marketing. With affiliate marketing, you have the seller here, the promoter here, and he just sells it wherever. It doesn't matter who. And he's not actually even physically selling, he's just promoting it. But any anybody can buy this, right? It doesn't matter who buys it. Um, so there there are um, some programs that uh, you can work with that do have somewhat of a 
somewhat of a system. I don't know why that's not working. Somewhat of a system or a program feeling to them, um, where they may maybe offer you, uh, for example, a, um, a pass up or something. Somebody that you bring in, you're still their referral to the to the affiliate program itself. So you may be able to receive a commission on that, but it's still the same concept. You're, they're basically, th th at that point, they still have to buy the product to become the affiliate. So they're still paying for a product. Um, that being said, you know, that's all I wanted to do with this video today was just kind of go through um, affiliate marketing, what it is, um, different uh programs or products that you can use uh, for affiliate marketing and if you guys want some more information on this like i said i do do a training uh, channel here where i actually teach people how to start earning with affiliate programs and i do it beginner friendly they're all step by step super easy to start using easy to get in with and actually follow along with but if you guys want to uh, check those out come check out uh, some of these these two top programs here are the top two that I work with that I earn the most money with and I see a ton of success with it myself and other people so if that's what you guys are interested in come check it out but that should clear up what affiliate marketing is for you I hope that that makes sense um, if you guys uh, have any more questions leave them in the comments or feel free to text the number down on the screen and I can answer any questions that you have um, feel free to jump into my Facebook group if you'd like other than that I hope you guys enjoyed it please do me a favor leave me a like on this video if you um, haven't subscribed yet subscribe and hit the bell icon so you're notified with my next video and I will see you guys next time